All right, all right. It's hot in here. I don't know if this lighting will work. <sighs> so the reason I won't talk about presbyopia because blog post on the subject below. If you ever read the blog today, today is the time to read it. Um, because this is not me, this is proper science. There's a book on Amazon that talks about real interesting findings about presbyopia. And I won't spoil it with my words here, but link below. And that study really shows, really puts to bed how I feel about presbyopia. Because I have never seen presbyopia in countries where they don't sell reading glasses. I mean, I spend a lot of time, a lot of time in countries that are, that are a little backwards, maybe less, less than super capitalist. And I see properly old people, old, I mean, we're talking 80s and 90s old, doing like serious close-up work that you need really good eyesight for. And presbyopia is age-related. It's a hardening of the lens, happens to everybody. The lens in the eye gets harder, so your focusing muscle, that circular muscle around it, has a harder time shaping the lens for close-up. That's the basic premise of presbyopia. It's not, it's not a fictitious condition like myopia is. It's a real thing. But at the same time, does it get so bad that you need glasses? Does the lens harden to a point that your focusing muscle can't deal with it? That's the real question. And the real answer to that is, <sighs> read the link below. That's the real answer. But, so that's, that's, and there's a lot of presbyopia going around and there's just a lot of, it's as big of a topic as myopia, if not bigger, because in the West, that's where you get sold once you're old enough to wear plus lenses make you see more clearly up close. And from there, it's a downhill slide. I mean, once you put lenses on your eyes, you can forget about it. But if you have presbyopia, like I don't have, I, to the best of my knowledge, I don't have any students that I've had for more than say three years or so that have presbyopia to point that they will have to wear glasses for it. None. And I've got thousands of students. So, this is anecdotal, this is not science, but I just don't, I, I don't see presbyopia. Like, I see it in the average population, but anybody who's aware of what lenses do to the eye, aware of how stimulus works, aware of where strain comes from, and puts those principles to use for an extended period of time, I just don't, I, I just have never seen it. And then, plus with that, like, all those places I've been where, where people really are old enough and are doing tasks that are so up close that you'd say, if you're gonna see presbyopia anywhere, it's there. And again, it's anecdotal, but I just don't see it. I think it's another one of those things where, you know, you could be 80 and start using a wheelchair. Sure you could. Be more comfy, right? Comfy rolling down the street. But do you need it, right? And what happens to your legs if you quit using them, especially at an advanced age? So you can't just quit wearing plus lenses if you're already wearing them. That's another whole long story. And this is part of the reason I won't talk about presbyopia because it is a big topic and it's a big money maker. And my hands are full with myopia. But if you want the occasional glimpse at presbyopia, today's blog post is a good example. And I can tell you real quick and then that's, that's it for today. I telling you, I will never need to wear plus lenses for presbyopia. I am predicting the future and I'm willing to place any bet with any of you guys that I will never need plus lenses to see up close. Figure that out. Anyway, that's it. It's just a little like for whatever video bit. If you like it, and subscribe to the channel. Leave me comments, let me know what you think. Do you have presbyopia? Do you believe in presbyopia? Stuff. And I'll see you in the next one. So my plan here, my plan here was to take care of a bunch of paperwork and stuff. It's raining season, like, if you're not used to Asia, the whole seasonal thing, and there's just raining season and there's not raining season, 
And when it's raining season, you're kind of screwed. Yikes. <laughs>